Alright boys and girls, welcome back. And today, guess what? I'm going to do a swirl pattern on a hard hat. That's right, your general purpose hard hat that you wear on building site. So if you want to stand out in the crowd when you're on site, I'm going to show you how to do a decorative paint finish to this hard hat, which is basically called a swirl. Right, first thing you're going to need is something, uh, this, something like this. This is basically one of the stands that you put your water butts on. Three quarter fill it with water, right? And get your hard hat and you take the insides out there, wedge something in like I have, a bit of wood, yeah? Because you're going to need to hold that as you dip it in. And the reason I'm using that, the water butt uh, stand is because that's about the only thing that the old app's going to fit in. I tried it in an empty, uh, empty tub, 10 litre tub of emulsion, but uh, it's just not quite big enough. It catches. So I've got it's just a mixture of paints that you probably use on site for doing like front doors, etc. So I've just got some black, uh, high gloss, some green, red some blue, and I might even whack a bit of amorite silver in there. You know that stuff, don't you? Well, some of you don't, because some of you don't paint the bloody pipes in the new plots, do you? So you already know what that is, but some silver. So just basic, uh, basic stuff you're gonna be using on site, basic paint you're gonna be using on site. So, without further ado, let me show you how to swell paint your hard hat. Right then, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pour a bit of red gloss in here. What I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna use a, a, a teaspoon to, to drop this in, right? So let's get a bit of red in there. Just whack it in. I want sort of like red as my main colour. And then just clean your spoon with a bit of rag. And add the next colour. So, dead easy thing to do, you know, not rocket science at the end of the day. Bit of green. Can't beat a bit, can't beat a bit of green, can you? Followed by your blue. I mean, there's many ways of doing this swirl, isn't there? You see all the videos. You know what I mean? And that's all I'm doing. I'm just basically just chucking it in. Just chucking it in, and like I'm quite happy with it with a pattern like that. To be fair, just give it a bit of a bit of silver. Like so. Get yourself a stick and just gently just give it a little bit of a swirl. Just 
That's how, see how you, you, you start getting that the line effect in it. Trying to just drag a bit more of that red in there, like so. Right, I'm just going to leave it like that. That's I'm quite happy with that. Right. Now you're going to have to just get yourself one glove, something like that, because you've got to submerge the hat. And then just basically slowly lower it in. Like so. And what you gotta do here. Just get that moved. And there you go. Simple as that. Not bad. Should stand out on the... Uh, Building the site with that, do you think? Right, guys. There you go. That's how to do the swirl on your hard hat that you're going to wear on the building site. Should get a few comments on that when you walk on site, shouldn't you? Yeah, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed that video. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll do you one in a bit, Dave, all right? Don't worry, I know you want one, I'll sort you out. So yeah, basically all I've got to do is somehow get rid of this shit because I'm doing it in my lounge and I don't, I can't really tip it on the plants, can I? So yeah, so get your order, take it outside, Give it a good few days. I'll probably give this a week, like, you know what I mean, to fully dry or something, depending on the weather. And then put the strapping system back in, in your order and away you go. And you should stand out on site like a sore thumb, shouldn't you? You know what I mean? So, I hope you enjoyed that little video on how to swirl your hard hat. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share from the candle man.